I'll put that orange and uh, orange and uh, white on, whatever it's called. Okay. Oh shit, we're about to find out. Oh, do you have a ride? I don't know what happens. I hope this. I hope he goes to jail. You can't say that. Yes, yes. I hope. I hope. I hope. Order in the court. Justice is served, and we're reconvening this matter. Uh, I've concluded my deliberations with uh, Judge Angel, and uh, there was uh, a great deal of material to go over in detail, uh, and a number of key issues to here, sort buddy. out. But um, this has been quite uh, quite a case. Feels like feels like at the onset of this case that I've been asked to either uh, legalize knife play or legalize kink shaming. I'm not going to do any of that today. Um, what I am going to do is, is, is examine, uh, what is a flawed case from both sides with a lot of inconsistency and, uh, -oh. uh more than likely a lot of dishonesty oh, shit. from witnesses on, on both sides, things that don't add up, things that were later recanted, things that were denied. Wait, where is uh, he? And these are the key facts that I think are going to decide this case. The video of the stabbing, uh, in in multiple reviews brought up some fascinating questions about uh i guess plausible deniability lilith fulker instructs vivek to leave before this attack takes place now that brings up the question of her motive for doing so bobby's already in the silver From a common sense perspective it would tend to indicate that she either wants him to be safe and away uh, should any trouble arise, or she wants to hide what she is doing from him. And without any way of knowing one way or the other, I'm not sure what his level of prior awareness is to her intentions in this video. And again, the accounts that we heard here today for the motives for the meeting the motives for uh, why why anyone did what they did on that day are all varied and conflicting. And uh, the wording of the charge for accomplice is clear in that Mr. Vivek wouldn't necessarily need to be there to be charged as an accomplice, especially after the fact. So we had to examine more so than any testimony uh, what what occurred after the fact with these uh, with these suspects, and uh, it has been demonstrated in this courtroom that uh, Mr. Vivek as well as Ms. Fulker did change their stories multiple times. First denying that they had even been there, and then uh, proceeding with this uh, knife play uh, affirmative defense. So with that in mind, it calls into question uh, Vivek's prior awareness as he's being told to leave the scene of this crime, alleged crime. As for the other video, while not completely damning uh, the footnote video of Carmine, um, it does not necessarily... <laughs> does not necessarily irrefutably prove a conspiracy to fabricate the knife story. It does demonstrate that multiple stories were being discussed, which is enough to reasonably conclude that multiple parties were in collusion to uh, create a narrative for this court case rather than uh, simply tell the truth. And, and while that is disconcerting, if I were to charge any one of you with perjury, I would probably have to find uh, a burden of proof high enough to look at all of you who testified today and likely have to charge many of you. So we're not going to deal with perjury. Oh my God, he just said everyone would get I, it though. I would though. say that probably most of the people who testified today were dishonest about something. <laughs> so everyone Back lied so no one gets it. And the charges. I'm the only one that didn't lie. Uh, I do find that... The knife story is implausible based 
on the supplementary evidence supporting its fabrication following the initial incident. So with that in mind, I will be finding Miss Lilith Volker guilty of all charges. Yes. And uh, <gasps> Mr. Vivek, again, because you did change your story multiple times. That, that, feel, that, feel good. that did cross me over in terms of reasonable doubt to find you guilty as well. Oh my <gasps> Jesus Christ! Thank you, Jones! Jesus Christ! Tell him I guess the World Cup Rob wins! January 6th! The one person that wanted to go to jail didn't go to jail, though. January 6th will tell you you won! January 6th, you won! I'll see you there, January 6th. Storm the city. Take it back on the city. Oh my god, they're taking it from the Mr. Ramaswamy, Ms. Lilith, fetch away from me. Thank god! Justice served! The justice system works. Okay, all right. Thank god! Thank you all for your time today. You've all been amazing. The gallery has been very well behaved. Round of applause for everyone. Judge hates our freedom! Look, I had all look, the songs. Look, 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 me, me, you, and Bobby, the three must be the Thanks, Rob. Max, be back. Our officers vest on and squad. surround them. The three the musketeers are 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 back together, man. It's good news. Right. Rob, stay safe. Okay.